What's up guys, Son of Beast here. Welcome to another play-in tournament. And this next matchup, it's the, it's the number one that we change things over and over. We have seen it so far that the Nets win the game at home against Toronto Raptors in Season 4. But the Raptors are looking for a revenge here tonight if they win and move on to the next round. And, and the other team with a loss of the 8th seed team of Brooklyn Nets. If they lose, that means they're going to play against the other team, the winning team in between the, in the Hawks of the attack game. That will be a lot of more focus that we have. Kyrie Irving, Seth Curry, Bruce Brown, Kevin Durant, and Andre Drummond are on the starting lineup. And on the other side is Fred Van Bleet, Gary Trent Jr., Bo Kananobi, Scotty Barnes, and Pascal Siakam. Time to send you over to Scotty at Bank Arena for the next part of the game. Oh, Canada, we stand on God. Tremendous range and remarkable 
efficiency. And the old man wasn't too bad in those categories either. Old Dale could put him in the hole. He let him come deep. Raptors and ball. And we've got to see that sensational mobile one block again. And that kind of rejection early on energizes your squad. The coaching staff just loves this kind of hustle. physicality that time on the defensive end from Drummond, using his body to wall up. Outside Irving. Outside Brown. Shoots over Ananobi. The shot, no good. And it's Toronto taking it the other way. Hey, both Curry brothers averaging well over 40% for three. How about this, B.A. Seth has actually been a tick more accurate than Steph. And of course, their dad, Dale Curry, was a tremendous marksman in his own right. This is a talented fan, no doubt. Hey, it's stolen by Irving! To the inside, Brown. Basket is good. Bruce nice Brown. From Irving. Irving Kyrie the Irving with the assist. His opponent with that nice imagination on offense. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. Fred Van They need the possessions for them. In the NBA, you just can't let guys get to the rim. Pass to Curry. Here's Brown. Up and in. Bruce Brown. Brown's got his second bucket of the night. Seth Curry with the assist. Hitting four of their first five shots. Siakam with it. Tosco! Siakam! Red Van Leek with the lead. They assist. Here's Drummond. Oh, and Nick. Andre Drummond. And here in the first, about three minutes in. Inside. Stolen by Drummond. Irving against Van Vliet. Outside Curry. Pass to Drummond. Toronto grabs the miss. Coming off that win against the Sixers. And you know, some games are plagued by false starts and slow momentum. You could tell they were getting frustrated. And you know what? Even though it was a frustrating night shooting the ball, they found a way to get it done and pull the Three pointer! Run, Bentley! Ultimately, is all that matters. And the evolution of Siakam continues. See him make great passes like that. I love Spectre's ball. I'm not sure what happened. And now changing it for the Toronto team. Raptors. So Toronto going with almost an entire new group here. Birch, he's checked in for Pascal Siakam. Achua comes in for Barnes. Mikhailuk's checked in for Trent. And it's Flynn in Achua. for Trent. Achua, Birch, 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 Brooklyn. Aldridge is checked in for Drummond. Hey, hey, you. Comes in for Durant. Thomas, he's checked in for Brown. And it's Mills in for Curry. And the Nets with possession here. The Raptors making their last shot. Irving, pass to Johnson, to the paint. Achua with a steal. Right side, Ananobi, over to the wing. Oh, he took him hard foul. Brooklyn foul. Number 18, John Johnson. His first foul. First team foul. Out of line. Shooting two for Toronto Raptors, number 22. Yeah, I think we should go back that way. I know some people feel otherwise, but I think we should go back that way because it is a recognition for a job well done during the regular season, these individual awards, so I wouldn't have a problem going back to the former way. Win. He's off on the first. So the Nets making a switch here. Dragic is New changes for Brooklyn. Number nine, Goran Dragic. And yes, Goran Dragic is back. Unable to play with Miami Heat. He now has another spot to go to to play with Brooklyn. Good on the second one. 149 left in the first quarter of the game. I post Aldridge. Pass 
to Johnson. Back to Aldridge. Doesn't go that time. Achua with some nice D. Wow, potent offense. It's been fun to watch. Three player! Real player! Taking it right to the defense. And what's working here? Each guy is well. How you with the assist? Now here's Johnson. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. To halt the run. And the Nets miss again. The Raptors have gone six of nine and finding their rhythm now. Pass to Ananobi. And 101 left in the first quarter. Here's Birch. Tries yet again. And he sinks the layup. Very good. Birch! Time out, Brooklyn. Time out called. Brooklyn. The last time they came together was in Toronto, where they fell to the Raptors. It's frustrating to lose such a close game. Felt like that last meeting was decided on the class. Typically there's one statistic that jumps out at you when you're looking at what decided the game. And in that one, it was all about the rebounding battle. teammates and uh, sets the standard for the rest of the game and how I want the, the game to go. You know, Grant, when he gets a lather going, Irving can seem like he's got the cheat code. Yeah, and if I'm the coach, he's got the green light from start to finish. When he gets rolling, it can rub off on everyone else. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter of action so far. Blake Griffin. Three points. Let's take a moment to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Raptors. Well, I like the fact they've already been getting a lot of high-quality shots in the paint. Also, their passing has been terrific in the first half. They'll be happy with all those assists. On the court right now, second quarter for the Nets. That's your bell. It's out there. Yeah. Hey, you. There's Blake Griffin, and it's Sharp in at the center position. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Thanks, Brian. Well, you want to talk about a super team. Last season, the Brooklyn Nets became the only team in NBA history to boast six players who made it Potty to the NBA over their career. Guys, the roster has changed just a bit, but make no mistake, this team remains loaded in a way we don't see too often. No question, Allie. Good stuff there. Thanks. Now here's Young. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. To the middle. Perfect pass to set up. Young is young. Four speed the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Pass to Mills. Griffin outside. And he 
Colin Raptors. Travis Young. Number 21. His first first team foul. Shooting two for Brooklyn. At the line for two for Brooklyn. Number 20. Number two, Blake Griffin. been getting it done, Fred Van Vliet. They've leaned on him to provide a lot of offense, and that's how he likes it. And you know what, they've come at him a few different ways defensively, and nothing has slowed him down. The Raptors with a lead. Van Vliet and Trent Jr. at the guard spots. Barnes is down low with Siakam, and it's Adenobi in at the small forward position. That's the group for Nick Nurse. Irving. Brown passes to Irving. Now here's Drummond. And that comes over. Andre Drummond. Durant. Durant's got three assists in the game. And you know, Drummond has Down no Durant. problem playing through sense. contact. He excels at using that strong body of his to fight through contact and fight. Red and blue. They've been going to him an awful lot this game, and you can see why. He's pouring it off. Pass to Durant. And here's Irving, guarded by Van Vliet. And the Nets, another Larry Irving. The confidence Irvin has is, is something I really appreciate. I mean, he's ready to shoot it as soon as he gets it and not afraid of any kind of shot. Now here's Barnes. Kevin Durant pulls it in. Well, you know, in high school he was a star. In college, the same thing. Durant got drafted second back in 2007. Then immediately became an all-star. And his Curry for three. Rebounded by Trent. The Raptors have got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. To the middle. And there's Brad Van Vliet. Van Vliet's got 16 Uber, points. Uber Junior. I like this execution coming out of the half. Solid. Three for four from the field so far. And Durant averaged over 20 points a game this rookie year. And Larry Irving. Three pointers. Well, since then, he's won just about every individual honor you possibly could. First ballot consensus Hall of Famer. Fred Van Vliet. Yeah, that defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets at the rim. Pass to Durant. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Here's Drummond. Rebound by the Raptors. Siakam's got four rebounds in the game. Barnes passes to Siakam. Trent against Curry. Now here's Trent. Defense is right there. Five on the clock. Three quarter Van Vliet. Durant pulls it in. Boy, they dodged one there, guys. I mean, he got the wide open look that he wanted, just didn't knock it down. Irving, pass to Durant. Now here's Brown. He's covered by Siakam. Back to Durant. It's stolen by Barnes. And here's Siakam for three. No good that time. So Brooklyn will take it the other way. They'll face the Jazz after this game. That'll be at home. And that's a one-game homestand for the club. And that one's Kyrie Irving. Bruce Brown with these hits. And that's when you just keep letting him do his thing. Just over three and a half minutes through the third. Back to Van Vliet. To the inside. And he goes over! Four! Four! He's sending a strong message with that jam. And that's exactly how you 
Two minutes remaining in the third quarter. Back to Drummond. Pass to Durant. Over on Anobi. Again, Kevin Durant. Boy, well, if you allow Durant that look, he's going to punish you. I mean, it's that simple. Back to Van Vliet. Down low. Here's Barnes. And a great assist. Oh, my Barnes. Brad Van Vliet with the assist. With that last one. Brooklyn has gone 6 of 8 from the three-point line of this matchup. Drummond finds Curry. Ananobi against Durant. Back to Curry. Over Trent. And again. Seth Curry. Boy, at the offensive end, his game is so impressive. I mean, he's a threat every time up the floor. Pass to Trent. Six. He was making a statement right there, man. Time out, Brooklyn. Keep that one in the career highlight reel for sure. Time out call, Brooklyn. A lot of great average here. It looks like the Raptors might be pushing their way in the wild card spot. And it looks like the other team, Brooklyn, may be down in the drain. And the Raptors could be playing against the number two seed since the second round of their average of the Sixers and the Raptors. This is what they face here last, excuse me, last time since 2019. And that was their average that they are trying to push their way up the floor. We may not know if they will make it all the way, but you'll never know when to come. And the Raptors with some changes. Machuas checked in for Siakam. Boucher comes in for Barnes. And Mikhailuk subbed in for Trent. Irving, the pass to Aldridge. Back to Irving. Inside, Durant. Basket is Kevin Durant. Set up for Irving. Kyrie yeah, Irving with the assist. I think Durant has trouble finishing through contact, but think again, folks. I mean, you can't measure desire by body type. Here's Mikhailuk. He has six. Three-pointer, Van Vliet. Knocks down. Three-pointer! Fred Van Vliet! He's got 12 points here in the second half. His third triple of the game. A little more success from out there in the second half. And it's good for Kevin Durant. Durant. Looking strong to the finish when Durant locks in on the Kyrie Irving uses. Seven-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Van Vliet. Out of bounds. Raptors ball. The Raptors making a switch here. Now changing for Raw Raptors. Number three. Well, you. An outstanding three. defensive play to earn the mobile one block. And this is exactly why he's out here in order to block shots in tight games like this. Almost done for the third quarter, and the fourth quarter will be coming up after the intermission. We've got 22 seconds left in the third quarter. Outside for Boucher. Van Vliet outside. Pass to Flynn. Six on the shot clock. Launches it. Rebounded by the Nets. Irving for three. Oh, it's good! Gary Irving for three. Whoa. That's the end of the third quarter. Brooklyn, 53, and Raptors, 51. Even when you don't have the clock to worry about. Mm. Kyrie Irving has been on display for the Brooklyn Nets. 11 points in the quarter. He's on fire. We'll be back in a moment. And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. One more quarter to go. Brooklyn's gone seven of nine from three-point range so far. On the court for the Nets as we get the fourth quarter going. Durant the three with Griffin at the four. Kyrie Irving. Kyrie out there with Kyrie Irving. And it's Aldridge in at the five, throwing the paint. Hey, the skills of Kyrie are... Marcus Aldridge with the assist. 
is underestimated strength. And here are the Raptors now. And that's making their last shot. Van Vliet right side. Goes back up. Oh, and he got fouled on his way out. Number eight, Patty Mills. His first, first team foul. Let's get a quick check. At the line, here are our Raptors. Number 25, Chris Boucher. In that regard. Shooting two. They've really been on fire from beyond the arc tonight, too. I mean, a lot of their points have come from out there. The first one falls. Barnes, he's checked in for Toronto. Checked in he's for checked Toronto Raptors, number four, Solomon Barnes. Boucher drops him over. Irving with it. Outside Durant. And good. Kevin Durant. The assist by Irving. Carter Irving with the assist. By four. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. Now here's Van Vliet. Over Irving. Shots blocked. Pass to Durant. Here's Griffin. Here he goes. The shot's good. Blake Griffin. And it's a six point net lead. Tom Rockets. They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. And Toronto calls time here. And KD always in the debate over who's the top dog in this league. And what's interesting is he doesn't really want any part of that discussion. He said, one thing I told myself, don't worry about who people say is the best player. Blocking out distractions is key to achieving greatness. Achieving a lot of greatness out there. There's a lot of three-pointers going on for... The Brooklyn Nets, 77.8 percentage, and only 57.1 percentage for the Raptors. There's too many turnovers going on here for Brooklyn, but only three for Toronto. There may not be any blocks yet for Toronto Raptors, but pretty soon there might be enough, there might be one. If there isn't, well, oh well, that's all that it takes. Let's get back here on the court after some making new changes. Keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Nick Nurse had to say to the team. He told them to be patient, work deep into the clock if you have to, but get good shots. He doesn't want them to look up at the scoreboard. He wants execution on each of those plays. Red Van Bleek. taking good shots at this point in the game, and that one was easy. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind the layup. Come on now. Kevin Durant. Durant. Durant's got four points this quarter. And Blake Griffin with the assist. assist. The offense is really clicking now. You know, the defense is really going to kept off now because of the outstanding. Three player! That's exactly the kind of shooting you need down the stretch to win games. Irving, pass to Griffin. Durant with it. He's guarded by Barnes. Back to Griffin, over Boucher. Rebound by Van Vliet. That's a shot he like, Meg. He's usually going to make those. Pass to Achua. Durant with a steal. To the right side. Outside Mills. Griffin in the post. Blake Griffin is there. And Griffin gets it to go. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and short, crisp passing. Purposeful passing it is, partner. Their last 10 points have all come off assist. Now here's Boucher. Driving inside. 
Pass to Mikhailuk. There's the triple. And another shot. Achua can't hit. Everything right except the finish. Have to keep focus all the way through the play. Griffin against Barnes. Now here's Griffin. Tight defense on him. Just five to shoot. Here's Irving. That one off the back iron and out. The Raptors have gone two for seven from the field here in the fourth. Not great. Barnes passes to Boucher. And first! Boucher! Time out, Brooklyn! Called by Brooklyn. Adjustments are part of every game, in every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. Now to five turnovers here for the Raptors. Six turnovers for Brooklyn. There are no blocks yet for Toronto Raptors, but just a, a nice steal turned out to be done. We gotta see who finds it much better. And now a moment to present the new balance player of the game, Kyrie Irving. Hey, <laughs> guess what? This was his game all night. I mean, he tore through the defense and almost never took a bad shot out there. Really, a level of offensive consistency most players can only dream of. Glad to see Kyrie Irving back. After playing with us a uh, long season during the pandemic, he's finally returning here on the court. But won't be able to play here at home. He will be playing away. The Nets with the lead. And he might be watching it on the court from the sideline. Which is really cool. Pass to Brown. And here's Drummond. Over Siakam. The shot by Drummond. No Two minutes remaining in his second half. Straight outside. Now here's Van Vliet. To tie it up. And the three three pointer. Fred Van Vliet. He's got 17 points here in the second half. Oh, he's playing out of his head. Yeah, he's hit the thing. The defense is scrambling to try to stop him right now. So far, no go. Now here's Brown. Here's Durant. Kevin Durant. Bruce Brown, Brown with the assist. assist now on this one. No stage too big for KD. You need a basket? He's your man. Here's Van Vliet. To take the lead. Sinks the three pointer. Fred Van Vliet. And he's still hitting those big shots. And it's a big one. What a performance from Long Green. Remarkable. Pass to Drummond. Now Irving. It's tipped. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Move the ball. Over there and in a bad time, too. You have to value every possession. Here's Irving. Outside, Brown. Now Drummond. He's covered by Siakam. Bruce Brown for three. Great to see guys. Full timeout. Toronto Raptors. Collected and confident in the biggest moment of the game. Yes. They're in Toronto. Close time here. They're behind by two. There's 48 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. There's a lot of patience going on, but we finally got a block for Toronto Raptors. And that was happening here in the fourth quarter. Tipped it away. Three-pointer average score, 80% for the Brooklyn Nets. 63 for Toronto Raptors. They really got to keep finding a way to get their in the better shape. And they're both tied up for six turnovers in the row. We're going to need to try to keep it right and the money to make it quick and possible. So both teams have one last timeout remaining. Next one scores, 
will be the timeout to bring them in here. There's 48 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Trent from all range. Three pointers! Only Trent Jr. Serving, guarded by Van Vliet. From outside, off the mark. So it's all come down to this. It's really that time for your leaders must have. Personal foul on Brooklyn. Number 11, Kari Irving. His first, second team foul. And an intentional foul right there. His first stop. 13 foul. The line for Toronto Raptors, number four. So, Marks. Two shots. He gets the first, and that'll put him up two. Final timeout for Brooklyn. That'll force them into a three-point attempt. Timeout call, Brooklyn. They're trailing by three. We've got 22 seconds left in the final quarter. All right, guys, what's your take? If they leave the arc open, take it. But it may be safer to get a quick two and then foul. Either way, they got to score the ball. They got a lot of pushing patience here, and they got to try to find someone to get there in a hurry. Toronto Raptors looking for a chance to take the win and in the wild card to face against the losing team of Charlotte Hornets. This will be the next matchup to face them on to give them another chance to try to stop the run. Let's see how well they can try to stop their handling pressure on the other team. So no timeouts for Brooklyn. Well, only one timeout for Toronto. Brooklyn with the ball. And here's Brown for three. And they get it back. Let's the three fly. Can't get the three to fall. The kick to Durant. Back to Drummond. Outside Curry. From deep. Brooklyn 68. And so many times we see these close games won by the home team. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. Hey there, I'm here with Pascal Siakam. The shots were falling for you tonight. How would you like to flow offensively? Uh, I like it. You know, we play for each other like we always do. Move the ball around, get the open shots. And today, we are doing it, so we got to continue to play. It's helpful when it goes in. Thanks so much, Pascal. Allie, thank you as always. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Grant Hill, Clark Kellogg, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching. We'll see you next time. Now it's time to present your three stars of the game for the players that did the best. And that was a revenge on them in Toronto. That was how crazy this game is. It was amazing. Unfortunately, the Brooklyn Nets couldn't answer back with another three-pointer. They are out and out of the target. They didn't have a chance. Here's your third star of the game. Starting off with number three, it was Kevin Durant. Didn't violation his run, but only 12 points in the game, four rebounds, five assists, and just a steal. I had no compilations on him, but Kevin Durant did really well done. He did a great job. Number two star, Toronto Raptors really got all pieces of us started, and that was how amazing this was here. But Kyrie Irving, the second star, 
with a 20 points, one rebound, five assists, two steals, and just got turned over. It didn't really help at all, but glad to see his nickname, Uncle Drew, back in the court for away game and back in home games to watch from the sideline. And for your number one star, the Toronto Raptors feel like the hustle and bustling. The best legendary, Fred Van Vliet. 29 points, just two and five assists. I like his run in this performance. He is the stoppable run. And they're helping the team taking in the final two of the play-in tournaments before heading into the playoffs. If they make it, then we will be seeing them play against the second seed, the Sixers, where they met since 2019 in a second round. So that's going to do it for here for today. Summit Beast is out of here. Make sure to keep your eyes tuned here for the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. Me and MeFone will be back here for commentating the games from first to the Eastern and Western Conference. And then we will bring back the commentators for the NBA Finals for the last game of the season. So, thank you all for watching once again. Peace out, everyone, for as a while as the NBA 2K22 dial and NBA Play-In Tournaments dial. Thank you all for watching this, and tune in for next time for the next one, Pelicans and the Clippers. That will be next happening here on Tuesday of Sun of Peace. Good night in Toronto, and we'll see you all again very soon. Did you know somebody?